Bienvenidos al comentario tech de PC Whiskey. Today we're going to be looking at the free disk partition software from Isas. As you can see here on partition-tool.com, they've got a home edition that is free. If any of you have any other recommendations on free partition software, by all means, leave a comment. This one is great. All versions of uh, Windows are supported on here, and it has much more features, of course, than the default partition or disk management software that comes with Windows. So that's why I thought I'd share this. Many of you have been asking me about moving partitions around, resizing, preparing your machine. Well, I've installed it, I've launched it. Here's an example drive that I have unallocated about 100 megs just for this uh, you know, demo. And um, it has lots of features inclu including defragmenting um, and uh, setting your partition as active, hiding it, stuff like that. You know, if I wanted to create a partition, I just right click on it, go ahead in here, put in the label, uh, specify if I want it to be a logical drive or a primary drive to boot up from for for example maybe you're setting it up as dual boot and you want to have another primary drive uh, the file system lots of file systems to choose from here not bad at all okay and uh, of course you have the ability to resize things quickly on the fly so I like that it kinda reminds me a little bit of partition magic which is an older uh, software uh, that I used to use a while back um, the interface is intuitive if you're not quite sure you know about how how things work obviously read the help that comes built in in the software um, and uh, it, it's straightforward to me I mean uh, for many of you that might not have used partition type of software disk management software this is really common all the features that you see here all the operations that appear on the left hand side here are um, quite good okay you do have quite a bit including hide partition deleting formatting, wiping it out, starting from scratch, uh, you know, things like that. So not bad at all with respect to the abundance of features for something that is free. Keep that in mind, right? It's free. Obviously, there's there's probably better out there, but you have to pay for it. Um, this one here is free, and uh, it gives you the ability to do much more than what comes with the default disk management software that uh, Windows has. So that's why I thought I'd show it to you. And it's good for all versions of Windows. You can use this on XP, Vista you know 2000 Windows 7 whatever it works on all of those and um, and as I said it supports different types of file systems as well so that's great so let me know what you think and uh, muchas gracias